Hi, it's Lou Manfredini, Aces Home Expert, and I'm gonna help you find a stud without a stud finder. Now, if you're looking to hang something on a wall, a lot of times you'll see uh, in the directions to say, try and find the framing underneath the wall. Now, what you gotta imagine, and here's a wall with a bunch of drywall. There's more than likely two by four studs behind here, and they're 16 inches on center. That is the spacing between the studs. So when you look at a doorway like this, there is a, a piece of framing material underneath this trim, more than likely right over here, right on the side there. And as you come across and you start to listen to this wall, you can sort of feel it as you knock with your fingers a hollow sound. Now I'm gonna stop talking. Hopefully you can hear this as I come over to where the stud is. I'm gonna move to my right. That sounds more solid to me than this. Now listen one more time. Hear the difference there? So now we're gonna assume that that's a spot where there's a stud. And to test that, I've got this little ladder in the way here, but we're gonna go this way there as well. I'm gonna put my tape measure right there. I'm gonna come over 16 inches, which is right here. So there's my spot here. And it hollows out. Hear that? It's solid again. One other trick. Take a look at this receptacle down here. When this electrical gets placed on a wall before the drywall goes on there, there is a stud either on the right side of it or the left side of it. And so if you go knocking, that's the hollow side. Hear that? That's the solid side. So you can find it by using your knuckle and a tape measure and your ear and it's the easiest way to find a stud. Now that's what I call love.